Today we're going to talk about, real quick, about basic operations. Okay, we're going to talk about basic operations. Now the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to create a small matrix of numbers. So we're going to create uh, five numbers, like this. Okay, uh, five rows by five columns, okay? 13, 14, 15. Now these can be any kind of values. It doesn't have to be specifically the same order. I'm just doing it to illustrate what I want to do. 24 and 25. Okay, so the thing that we're going to do is we're going to add and create basic arithmetic, or we're going to do first uh, sums, which means that we're going to add numbers. Now, the first thing that we have to do to create an operation, uh, to create an operation, we place ourselves in any cell. We push the equal key. And then we're going to select one of the cells, like this, and it's automatically going to be signaled out here. So we selected A2. Then what we're going to do is we're going to add the plus, and then we're going to add another cell right here, which is going to be A3. And then we hit enter, and what's going to happen is that it's going to add 1 plus 2, and it's going to say that it equals 3, which means that it's correct. Now we could also do this for several different cells. So let's say that we select the first one, we push a plus, we select the second one, plus, third one, plus, fourth one, plus, and the last one. So it's adding A2 plus A3 plus A4 plus A5 plus A6. We click on it and it adds 15. So I guess that it is correct. Now, we could also do this with uh, several different cells. It doesn't have to be all of these exactly. It could be several of them in a different order. So let's say that we select this one, we push plus, we select whatever we want, it doesn't matter. So it's going to be A3 plus C4, that's two plus 13 equals 15, I think. So we hit enter, and it also adds 15, just like the previous one. Okay, but we can also add a few more by clicking here on the top on the formula bar. We click on it here, we put another plus, and we can select any of any other ones from anywhere. Okay, and so we got A3 plus C4 plus C5. So that's 2 plus 13 plus 24. It's going to be 39. So there you go. Now, there's a much easier way of doing uh, adding or uh, sums in this case. So we're going to erase these over here and we're going to push the equal key, okay? And then we're going to write the word sum, S-U-M, like this. We open parentheses, okay? And we are going to drag all of these. So we're going to drag from A2 to A6, just like it says here. We're going to close the parentheses and we're going to hit enter and it's going to give us 15. So now it's adding all of these. Okay, and we could do this for any of the columns, okay? So sum, we select all of them, like this, from B2 to B6, and it adds them up, so it's 40. Now this is another thing that we can do. We can select these, and it's going to show us the sum here, down here. Sum, 15. Same thing over here, we do the same thing. We, we add these, and the sum should be 40. So this is correct. Now, another cool thing that we could do is we could copy this. We copy it from here from edit. We copy it. And then we move to wherever we want to paste it. And uh, so now we're going to paste it. And now the cool thing that it does is that in this one, it's adding column B. But when we copy it, it adjusts itself to column C. So now it adjusted itself. And we can do that for, for the rest of them. So we copy this one. We paste it here. And it adds that column. We grab this and we paste it here and it adds this column. We could also do this horizontally. So let's say that we do the sum like this. We select all of these like this. It's going to add these up. We hit enter and it's giving us 55. Now if we select it like this and check down here, 55 the sum and here 55 is the sum which means it's correct. Okay, so we copy this again and it copies it you know, in the same way. We could also do the uh, a matrix. Check this out. We hit click, we click on equal, we do sum, we open parentheses, and we select everything all the way down here. Okay, we close parentheses, or we don't, it's possible if you don't want to, but you hit enter, 
and it gives us a sum of 325. If we do this like this, it tells us that the sum is 325. So it's as simple as that. That's basic sums, basic operations. Just for the sake of making it look different, we can make this bold. Here we can make it bold as well. And we can make this bold as well. So there you go. Simple as that.